Right, Tom. First, the school district said the signups for the meal kits has gone extraordinarily well. They had 12,000 surveys filled out for people to get those kits, and the five-day meal kit will be available each week from the school district. But they really wanted me to reiterate that each week you'll need to sign up for the following week. So today, of course, the deadline for the first round. If you didn't make tonight's deadline, well, the district says that people will have an opportunity to do so again for the next distribution. The meal kits will provide a pre-made breakfast and lunch for five days, as we've been talking about. And the district says, while they know many families struggle, the first few signups will really give them an idea of what to expect and they can help be prepared with the right numbers throughout this whole process. However, the district really wants us to talk about a different program for families that can help provide groceries. It's called the Pandemic EBT, and if people qualify, it can help get people up to $399 a child to pay for groceries. And this is a program that has not gotten much response. Here's who qualifies for the pandemic EBT. If your child qualifies for free and reduced lunch prior to the pandemic, well, then they qualify for the pandemic EBT. Over the summer, the district says applications were low and they say state money is on the table for people to use. Under 50% of those eligible have applied, so the deadline was extended until tomorrow. Again, that ends tomorrow, that deadline. Line. If you want to get signed up for this, the money is given in a debit card form that can be used at many grocery stores and is specifically designed for buying food. So again, we just want to let you know that that sign up ends tomorrow. So they're encouraging people to find out more about it. Easy way to find out about it, about both these programs, is to text us the word MEALS to the text number 509 448 2000 and we will send you all the information the links to both the meal kit program through Spokane Public Schools and the pandemic EBT which can help you get money uh, per child to help pay for groceries so we hope you do that reporting live Laura Papetti from 2 News